In this video, we are going to talk about the design and layout for round walls and square windows. So let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to use three different models here. And this one here you can see is a shorter curve to it, a little little more here. And of course, this one is a is a half circle here. They are 12 foot wide, and I'm just kind of giving you the dimensions of what I drew them at. So this right here would have been 12 feet, and this would have been 12 feet. So we have a six foot half circle there. I came in four foot with that one and seven foot with this one. Go ahead and remove the walls. You can see we got the same thing. I'm going to get rid of this. Now, the first thing I wanted to show you, and we can see here, I went ahead and put the windows in, put different ones. We got two foot windows here, four foot windows, and three foot. This is going to be the first place you are going to go to see if you can even put these windows in or if you're going to like the looks of them after they are in. Two foot window here, you can see this is two inches by two foot it would pretty much fit in this area here. Now, you will be able to move them out or move them in also and uh, do a little more finishing with the inside of or the outside of the building. And I'm going to try and give you some examples of that also. It's probably going to be about a four or a five part video series to this one here. And I'll put links to all of them at the end of the video and they'll be on the website. Here's a three foot window. We can see this one here is even with the inside, but sticking out on the outside. Same thing here. All, all we'd have to do is move this in to have it sticking out on the inside and even with the inside or even with the outside. Here we have it even with the outside sticking into the inside, but it's all a little less. It's hard to notice. You're kind of looking at this and, you know, if we go back to the other one, let's just kind of take a look at this window here. And even this one here, let's go back to the other one You can kind of see it doesn't look like it's much, you know, it's because it's a smaller window. The bigger windows are definitely going to look like they're not going to work on some of these. Um, and I have a two foot window here. A one foot window will fit even better. And of course, you can buy curved glass, curved windows to fit in these also. But it could be a little pricey. Small one here, and you can see where these are actually fitting in. You could kind of make these work a little easier, especially the three foot one on this radius here. Let me go ahead and make the walls to give you an idea. They are eight foot tall to scale, and I'm going to go ahead and bring the center line out to the front and then draw a little line here. Remember, this is a center line. We are going to center the windows in here. Go ahead and put the windows in. Let's go ahead and take a look at what they look like. You can see here the square window, flat surface, flat even plane, is going to be even with the corners and it's going to be setting in a little bit for, because the wall is round. This one here has got a little bigger curve. You can see it's a little bit, a uh, little more here. Um, we could kind of pretend like that one was a half inch. This one might be an inch and a quarter here, but we're still even with the corners. The one with the half circle is going to be a little bit deeper here if we line it up with the corners. Let's go ahead and take a look at the top here. Remember the top will be the same. And again, I'll give you some more information on trimming that stuff out in another video. The bottom here, we could actually move this window in a little more if we want. It looks like we have about a half inch space here. And the corners, let's just pretend like we got about an uh, inch and a half here, something like that. Well, we would. It's a two inch frame. So three and a half inch window. We can pretend like that is one inch because that's what it would be, not two inches. Another spot here, or same kind of a thing. This one here, we've got the room. And this one, we would most definitely have the room because this is the smaller radius, or I mean the larger radius. Take a look at the bottom here. Like I said, we could move this window in if we wanted a little more room on the outside. A two-foot window 
for this particular um, radius or uh, rounded window, rounded wall would uh, probably fit in here with, with uh, out a lot of uh, problems. You could always check your floor plans. Start with what we did in the beginning and see what windows are going to fit in the walls. And this is a two by four window. You can always go with a two by six window or even a two by eight window if that uh, would help you solve some of your problems with installing the windows. Okay, we had two foot windows. Now let's take a look at four foot windows with the same walls. We can just, just trying to give you an idea of what you're going to be up against here. I'm gonna whip through these. See this here, we got a little bit deeper. And this one here, we're not in a happy place here with the sharper radius or the half circle here. Top again is going to be the same as the bottom. We can see here where it is sticking inside uh, quite a bit. And the reason why I'm making this right here is just to give you an idea of the, how the wider windows aren't going to work as well as the smaller ones or the ones with smaller widths. Again, this one here sticking inside. Four foot, uh, two footer. Again, if we put use two two foot windows, they're going to work a lot better than the four foot one here. And that is it. That is it for this video. I will make a few more videos and put links at the end of this video for you so that you can be a little more enlightened or confused for that matter.